Hey guys, welcome to Body Pump. If you are new, Body Pump is the world's most popular barbell strength training class. So in today's workout, all you need is a barbell with a light set of weights on it, and then some weight choices off to the side so that you can add weight as you progress through the class, or I'll be showing options with dumbbells. So if you have dumbbells, you're gonna use two dumbbells today. Um, a couple of different weight choices is ideal, but if you only have one set, that's totally fine too. We recommend for the warm up, if you have it, do small or two medium dumbbells. Um, if you're new, and if you're new using the barbell, you're gonna use a light to a medium warm up weight. In all of our classes, we use what's called the Smart Start Training Approach. That just means if after four or five songs, you feel like you've gotten enough out of your workout for today, feel free to push stop, cool down on your own with some light stretching, and when you come back to class next time, add another class or song. Every time you come back, continue to add another class or another song or another track, and eventually you'll make it through the entire class. Good deal. We are going to start with what we call the set position. So it means the feet are under our hips in our strong anatomic position, rolling our shoulders back and down, lifting through our chest, and bracing through our belly. If you're using the barbell, go ahead and bend over and pick it up, and you're just going to have the hands slightly outside the legs, about thumb's distance from the legs, and if you're using the dumbbells with me, we're just going to have our palms in front of our thighs. Music, please. All right, awesome, guys. We're just going to warm up together. Heavy in our heels. Soft in our knees. Strong through our belly. And let's get strong and lean, right? Deadlift. Two and two. Down. Down. Up. Up. So we're sliding our equipment to the front of our kneecaps. And then standing tall at the top. Stacking our ribs over our hips. And we're going to add on it. Two deadlifts. Up right row. Two two. Up. Up. Down. Switch it. Deadlift. Alright, now on the up right row. Elbows high and wide. So no higher than the Keep it going. Drop, lift, up, down. So, in that head lift, guys, tuck your chin, eyes back to the floor, and we're just sliding our hips as far behind us as we can. So, check it out. Find a drop, and our hands straight. So, it's a warm fire. New move, high pull, single. Lift, drop. So pushing the balls of our feet, lifting through our heels, equipment, upper rib cage. And drive through our hips, right? Alright, got one more. Dead row, slow. To the knees, to your belly, to your knees. Stand tall, repeat. Out, out, in, in, out, out, up. Up. So, all about control, and as we pull our equipment in, elbows slide back for a pitch. As feet, single. Out, in, out, up. So, think about every time you're pulling up, shoulder blades squeeze together, opening your chest, and warming through your upper back. One more, one more. Change direction. Slow clean and press. Up, up, drop, push, push. Catch, catch, release, repeat. So smooth and steady. Fast elbows, get up under the equipment. Bend the knees to the side. And just breathe, right? How are you getting that one more? So we're just gonna add speed. Single, hit, drop, push, catch, set. Starting feet start lifts. So as you lift, we're just go back, come forward, back, forward. T 
two more? So again, it's really warm, right? Alright, barbell up and over. Dumbbell jacks. Advanced single squat. Drop, push. So as you sit our hips back, knees come straight forward, and quads start to warm. Heel to toe, wide, single, down, up. And now our knees, push out to the two feet, chest to chest. Right leg, get back, stay full of one. Down, up. And we're just searching for 90 degrees in the left. So back knee under the hip, front knee over the hip. Don't stop. Step in to side to repeat. Drop, push. And we're just trying to get our back knee about a quarter inch away from the floor, guys. Step in, bars it over, leg leg. Two, one. Two, one. So, hips go back. Chest and hips forward. One more. All right, you got it. Dead row. Single. Out. In. Out. Up. Are you warm yet? One more, guys. And shoulder roll. Awesome. That's the warm up. So we're going into squats. If you're using the barbell and you're new, you're gonna use up to double what was on your barbell for the warm up. If you're using the barbell and you're regular, you're gonna use between two and four times whatever was on your barbell for the warm up. Set that up now. If you're using dumbbells with me, you can either use two dumbbells in the rack position, just like you saw, or one dumbbell between the palms, and we're just gonna have it horizontal, up to you. If you're new, two small or two medium, or one small or one medium. And if you're a regular, two medium or two large, or one large to extra large. Set yourself up now. We are gonna start in the mid stance. We will progress. There are three different squat stances as we progress through the track. That way we can recruit different muscle fibers from our lower body and just really accelerate the fat burning process, building muscle and getting really lean and really fit really fast. Mid stance, grab your equipment. If you're using the barbell, up and over. So it's on the meaty part of your back or shoulders. From your set, one heel, one toe out, brings us to mid, music please. Awesome guys, so soft in your knees, heavy in your heels, breathe into the body, and we're gonna start smooth from the top, gang. Squat, two, two. Down, down, up, up. So every time we sit, it's like we're sitting in the chair. Our knees come straight forward, our hips all the way back, and the range of motion we're looking for is hips to knee line. One more. Tempo change. Three, one. Three, two, one. Flip. All right, so wait. And then explode by digging through your heels, back and hips under your wrist. Feel the difference? Combo. Single squat. Single squat with heel raise. Lift. Down. Up. Down. Lift. So by lifting the heel, we bring the calves into the work. Shaping and tone. Bottom. Hold. Three. Two. Heel raise. Lift. Or not. So option guys, if the heel raise is too much, you can just stand tall. Starting position, right? But no matter what option you're in, you gotta try to find the bottom of the squat and stay in the bottom two inches. And that's what brings the motion for the pole thing. One more. Pull. One heel, one toe. We squat, we're two. Down, down, up, up. Awesome, team. So settle back in. Lips back and down. Pushing into the heels and our knees wide towards our pinkies. Tempo change. Three, one, three, two, one, drive. All right, so they need to go a little bit more. Squeeze a little deeper at the top because you know it's just available. 
combination, single squat. Single squat with your wrist. Lift. So, for real challenge, controlling the timing, right? Keeping your tension, working the muscle. Bob, hold, three. And big lift. Yes! So continuously putting pressure into those target muscle groups in order to shape, in order to tone, in order to accelerate our strength. Come on. Two up. Power and slow down. Four, 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 three, two, one, four, three, two, one. What? One more. Breathe in the body. Heel the legs. You got this. Hold the top. One heel, one toe. You squat for two. Down, down, up, up. All right, check down. As you get tired, the weight starts to shift forward into the front of the feet. Push into the heels to keep the hips sliding back and keep the target muscle groups in the work. Game. You know it. Three, one, down, 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 rise. Feel the power, feel the build. Because you know the combo. Check it out. Single, squat, heel break, lift. Or not, right? If you're starting with squat and control, just keep your squats around. Otherwise, Bottom, hold, three, and heel raise. Go. Push to the floor. Explode up. Out of the ground. Halfway, team. Go. Can you drop? An eighth of an inch lower. This is how we shape. This is how we tone. This is how we shrink. And let's finish. Four, 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 three. Two, one, four, three, two, one. One more. Yes, you can. Yes, you can. We're almost there. Step together. Done. Done. Equipment down. Equipment down. Let's stretch. Heel, glute. Knees together. Squeeze your thighs. Tailbone. Roll up towards the screen. Lifting the chest. Pulling up the back of the head. Release. Switch sides, repeat. Awesome. So we're going to chest. If you have a bench, you're gonna use it on this track. Um, you will see push-ups. So if you need a mat for your knees, set it up behind your bench. If you have a bench, if you're using the barbell and you're new, you're going to take half the weight off of the barbell from the squat track. If you're a regular, you're gonna take between a third and half of the weight off of the barbell, separate from your barbell. Two plates that are the same size for chest flies that you'll see in the back half of the track. So those two plates, if you're new, should be too small or too medium. And if you're regular, too medium or too large. Once again, the plates will be off to the side. The mat should be set up for push-ups. The barbell should be set up because that's what you're going to start with for chest presses. If you're not using the barbell and you're not using the bench, you're with me. We're going to do everything on the floor. So set your mat up on the floor because we're going to do all of our chest presses, flies, and push-ups on top of our mat. Good deal. We're going to use our dumbbells. So, if you're using dumbbells with me and you're new, too small or too medium. If you're regular, too medium or too large. And we're going to set up in the supine position. Back flat. Feet close to the butt, guys. If you're using dumbbells, press under the shoulders. If you're using the barbell, wide grip, that means. From shoulder systems apart, you're gonna go one hand systems further out towards the end of the bar. Music, please. Back is flat, abs are solid, shoulders roll down. Connect to the bench or to the floor. And we're just gonna start smooth and steady. Chest press, two, two. Down, down, up, up. So every time you lower, guys, elbows wide, no lower than the top of your bench. Range of motion. Down fast, hold, squeeze, and rise. Yes, so big squeeze the bottom. And as you push up, squeeze the knee deeper into your chest. One more. Slow it down. Three, 
four, four, three, up, up, bottom, hold, triple, three, two, hold, and four. All right, guys, just hold, please. Find the bottom of the chest press, and your bottom two inches. That's the range of motion. One more. Smooth it out. Two, two. Down, down, up, up. You got this. So smooth and steady. Push in the back, deeper into the bench top. For more isolation, starting muscle groups. Down, back, hold, squeeze. And ride. All right, so try to make the rise go slow. Then push it to the top. Keep dropping the next rep. Continue to switch your strength. Slow it down for more. Four, three. Keep rolling. Up, up, bottom, hold, okay, three, two, hold, explode. All right, so action push up, guys. Back push it down, chest squeezes. More muscle in the group, more calories you burn. Single, kick, drop, push, and the more muscle you build, right? And that's really what it's about. Because when you have really nice muscle, you're able to actually burn calories even when we're not in class. Come on. Four. Three. Alright, you got one more. Down and hold. Sit up and set up for push up. So if you're using the bench, you're behind the bench, hands are on the bench top. If you're on the floor with me, hands wide, chest forward, palms flat. Option, knees or toes. Squeeze the belly from the top. Slow. Four, three, two, one, four, three, you know it. Bottom hold, three, two, one, push. So I'm looking for a up. Take a pull at your elbow crease. Add your solid. And take it in the open hand. You know it. Single, two, eight. Yes, you can. It is getting hard. Bring the knees in closer to the hand. But dive your chest forward. And if you want more of a challenge, hop on your toes. Hold. Alright, grab your foot. Two plates or two dumbbells. Two high positions from the top. Chest slide. Two. Two. Down. Down. Up. Up. Smooth it out. Down. Back. Hold. Squeeze. Alright, so check it out, guys. Arms are long and straight, except for a slight bend in the elbow. So as we open, it's like we're opening wide for a chest, giving someone a giant hug. Four. Four. Four, three, two, one. Slow to the top. Build it in. Bottom. Hold. Okay. Three, two, one. And push. Is it hard yet? Yeah. Never easy. Always worth it. Kick it up. Single. Twelve. Down. Up. Yes, you can. So I know your back is starting to lift. Push that cover down. Squeeze the chest. Control the body. And result to the spray muscle. Right? I need four. Gotta make them M O V E S. Be willing to pass that test. Gotta make them M O V E S. Be willing to pass that test. Sit up. Put it down. One more round of push ups. So behind the bench or on the floor with me. Hands wide. You've got 10 seconds. So breathe. Are you on your knees? Are you on your toes? Set up. Show up. Slow for four. Four. Three. Two. One. I know it. Bottom. Pull. Kick. Three. Two. One. Big push. So try to take it to the heel of the head. As you push away. Feel the difference. And let's take this home, guys. Singles. Down. Up. So knees. Knees in closer. Four. Hit challenge. Onto your toes. Because you know you've got two left. One more. Hold. Yes. 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 Up and down. Lifting your chest and heart to the ceiling. Awesome job. So we're going in the back. Ryan's going to. Yeah. 
Help me with the music. Ah, so we're going in the back. If you're using the barbell, guys, and you're new, chest weight or slightly more on your barbell. Put your bench, put your mat off to the side. You do not need them in this track. If you're regular, you need regular back weight or slightly more. If you're using the barbell, you also need one plate or one dumbbell close by. So if you're new, that should be a small or a medium. If you're regular, that should be a medium or a large. And we're going to see squat and presses with that equipment in the back half of the round. So just have that off to the side because you will once again start with the barbell. If you're using dumbbells with me and you're new, too small or too medium. If you're regular, too medium or too large. When the barbell team switches to the plate, we're either just going to keep the dumbbells in the rack position for squat and presses, or you can grab one dumbbell and turn it sideways, rack position, same execution, same uh, muscle group stimulated, same benefits. Good job. So grab two dumbbells to start, or your barbell. Set position, guys. <sighs> Music, please. All right, so check it out. Feet under the hips, abs in embrace, shoulders down, and we're checking in, right? Power training track. Together we achieve more. Deadlift, two, two, dead row. I like single dead row. This is why Ryan was going to teach it. Oh. All right, so open the chest, elbow slide past the wrist, shoulder blades to piece together, team. And we're going to add on girl. triple row. Out, three, two, Stand up, repeat. Squeeze against the upper back, feel the belt. Call for one, one three, one press. Drop, push, catch, single row. Out, in, so put it together. One clean and press, one dead row. And in the clean and press, back to the get it really quick. In the row, squeeze through the upper back. Two more. All right, last one, guys. Feel the build. Feel the power. Far down. Now we're just going to shake it out. Bend the knees. Torso twice. Extend the shoulders. Extend your core. A little flush of the legs. Keep the equipment up. Check back in. Dead row. Singles. Go. Out. In. Out, rise. So think about stability in the body. Chest face up. Does not flip, just pull with the logo. Straight pull. And by keeping the chest still, we're creating more isolation through the back of the body. Come on. Come on. Feel the build. One clean, one press. Drop, push. Single row. Out, in. So what are we doing here, guys? Full body integration. So you've got to bend the knees, work through the legs, power through the seal, and then squeeze the upper back, opening the chest here. Different muscle groups. Shape, tone, and strengthen at the same time. Two more. Push. Pull. Last one. All right, guys, equipment down. Grab one plate, or one dumbbell, or wrap the two. Squat, press, so mid stance. We're loading the legs by bending the knees and then digging through the heels, exploding through the ceiling. Drop, push. How many more? All of them. Come on. Almost there. Catch it. Hot. Great. Luna Moss, one more time. Shake it out. Grab your equipment, barbell or dumbbells. Same. Set position. Dead row. Singles. Out. In. Out. Up. Settling back into the body. Breathe into the hard lungs. So you know we're going to build it back. Feel the intensity. Triple row. Out. Three. A little more squeeze. A little more control. And we'll watch that, right? Because you feel the energy. You feel the music. One play, one press. Kick. Single row. 
on the other side. So grabbing your plate or dumbbell, knees under the hips, the foot and overhead, overhead extension, two and two. Down, down, down and hold. Rise low. So try to stay stable, which means we're not leaning back as we lower. Squeezing deep in the belly, more isolation, back of the heart. Equipment down, tricep push up, set up, bridge shoulder, floor bench, two and two. All right, and this time guys, side point to the left. So open, push, same, two and two push up, left side plank. And we've been here before, right? So now that you know what you're doing, if you want to make it more challenging, try sliding your knees further back as you dive your chest forward. Or come all the way up onto your toes and then rotate edge of the foot in the side plank. That's an option. Oh. One more. Are you ready for isolation? Down for two. Hold for four. Up for two. Repeat. Down, down. Hold, 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 hold. Up, up. Knees in if you need to, guys. Let's stay with me. Don't just quit. Commit. Hold. One plate or one double. Stay fine position. On top of the bench, if you have it. From here, we're up, over, up, down. So now let's take your chest. As we lift, pushing straight up and then coming over to 90 degrees in the arm. Equipment, slightly higher than the forehead. Does that feel good yet? All right, turn hand on, hip lift, hip drop. That's it. So lift the hips, as you push up, knees to your glutes, and try to keep your hips as high as you can see. Low more strength, posterior chain. Oh my goodness. Keep it going, the iron, stick it in the needle. Squeeze the elbows. There, guys. You got to step it up. Come on. One in the tank. One in the tank. And let it go. Done. 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 Let's try it. One hand. Flat on the back. Pull the elbow towards the center of the head. Lift through your chest. Awesome, awesome. Shake it out. Switch sides. Repeat. Awesome, awesome, awesome. All right, so we're going into biceps. If you're using the barbell, on the barbell, you need nothing because you need two plates. So, two plates. Or to the barbell. <laughs> Think about that. I was getting confused with the shoulder track. We're all still learning. All right, so yeah, you're gonna use the barbell. I'm gonna use plates. Okay, so we're gonna use plates. So two plates. Uh, if you're new, too small or too medium. If you're regular, too medium or too large. If you're with me and you're using dumbbells and you're new, too small or too medium. If you're regular, too medium or too large. Good deal, good deal, good deal. We are going to start in our set position, bicep track. So in this track, a little bit of weight goes a long way with proper execution and range of motion. So if you start to lose form, I'd rather you drop to a lower set of weights and do the movements correctly because quality is definitely more important and the load will come with time. We have to master the setup first because there's levels to this. Grab your equipment. Set position. There's levels, to this. There's levels to this. Music, please. Awesome, awesome. All right, square your hips. Right leg back. Shoulders down. Palms to the side of the thigh. And we're just feeling good, right? Bicep curl, guys. Two, two. Up, up, down, down. So elbows through the shoulders. Chest is up. Belly is tall. Step in, a fast, hold, squeeze, release, slow. All right, guys, so I see left, equipment in front of the shoulder, never touch it. 
Four more. Filling it in. Mid range triple pull. For three, two, one. Drop. So look for an inch bow. Inch below the belly button. Four nine fingers. Elbow. Get locked in place under the shoulders. Top bow. Single row. Kick. Out. In. Bicep curl. Up and hold. Squeeze. And release. Slow. So one row. One curl. Isolation. Control. Yes. Yes. They ask me what I'm doing, man. I'm just doing me. One more. Alright, you guys got it. Get on the other side. Let's play. Step back. Two and two. Up. Up. Down. Down. So try to keep the shoulders down. Because as we get tighter, they try to pop up. Shoulder blades squeeze together. Drop over here. Step in. Up and hold. Squeeze. Release. So you're not just dropping the weights, guys. Control it on the way up. Control it on the way down. Feel it. Mid range. We hold for three. Three. Two. And what happens? As you get tired, you try to lean back. So you're going to go back to the work. No. Push into the feet. Stabilize your core. And pick your biceps. Do the work. Come on. One more. Single arm curl. Right, left, twist. Alright, so check this out. Pinky. Outside of the shoulder. More synchronization. More muscular curve. And more results. Both plates. Four, 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 three, two, one. So breathe into the body. Because you know we're going to do it. One more time, right? Maximum effort. Combo. Single row. Out, in, bicep curl, up and hold. Squeeze, release. All right, come on. Feel a little more tight. Shoulder blades squeeze together. And a little more control. On the way down. Because the key is making every breath better than the last. That's how we continue our results. Spread like that. Two, two, up, up. Got it? Is every direction more into the next? Continuous tension. Step in, up and hold. Squeeze. Drop. Slow. Big pull. Not lean in the way. Stand tall. Feel it. Feel it. Bottom half. Triple pull. Chin and kick. Drop. So check this out. Content or decent or It's not this. It's with full control as we lift, as we pulse, and as we drop. Because the results happen in both direction, guys. On the way up and on the way down. You got it. Single arm, right left. Curl. Curl. Come on. A little more twist. A little more power. A little more rolling. You want to finish this together? Yep. Both plates. Four. 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 Three. Two, one, four, three, two, one. You're almost there. Don't quit now. Shoulder roll. Yes! Yes! Awesome, guys. And your arms should feel like yellow. That's how you know you did it right. Push out. Thumbs up. Like you're making your chest as wide as possible. Give me someone a giant hug. Thumbs down. Thumbs to the back of the room. Awesome, awesome, awesome. We're going to take the fingertips. We're going to push down away from the palm. And then we're going to push up towards the ceiling. And then we're just going to repeat on the other side. And we're going to head into the lunges. So if you're using the bench top, this is super important. If you have a mat, put it under the bench top. You do not need any risers. You do not need any risers. So remove them. So bench top, if you have a mat, put it under it. Just so it prevents it from slipping. Because you are going to do squats on top of the bench. And you'll step behind the bench with one foot still on the bench in order to perform your lunges. The deal, so I don't want... The bench to move underneath you. Safe, effective exercise. That's what we're about. Good deal. If you're not going to use the bench, you're going to be with me. Everything I do on the bench, we're just going to do it on the floor. You do need either one plate or one dumbbell. So if you're new, it should be a small or a medium plate. If you don't want to use any weight, that's cool too. Two, two, you'll still get a really good workout. Tired. Yeah, I know, right? Um, if you're a regular, one medium or one large plate or dumbbell. 
We are going to start here using the bench, center of the bench, mid stance. So feet slightly higher or wider than the hips, elbows in, and this is where your equipment should be. And if you're on the floor with me, same position, or just grounded. Music, please. All right, guys, two single squats and one back step in line. You ready? Let's go. Down for two. And now right leg moves back, one left. Step in, two squats. And then we're just gonna run to the other side. So left leg back, drop it down. Lift up, repeat. Down, up. So it's a big step, 90 feet between the legs and the left. And you feel the middle, we're gonna take it up. Right leg step back, triple, pull, lunge. Step in, switch side, repeat. Three, two, one, lift. So every time you step in, guys, digging through our front heel, firing through our glutes, bending the pole, staying in the bottom two inches of the lunge to get maximum muscular recruitment. One more. Upward in the right hand. Single row. Right leg steps back. Pull in. Push out. Same side. Back. Lift. Draw. Tap. So square your hips, tuck in your chin, and now as you pull in, elbow slides past the ribs, and equipment side of the rib cage. Same side, single back step in plank. Back, drop, lift. Same side. One, two, that's it. So what we're looking for? Step to the left. So the bigger we make the step the more room our body has to get full contraction of our target muscles. Two more. I know you all more. You know this is the build. Combo is coming. Check it out. Back step in lunge. Triple pull. Overhead press. Step in mid hands. Triple pull squat. Right side only. Three, two, one. Bring it down. Three, Two. So this is tricky, right? With the dumbbell or with the equipment. So if this is a little too much for you, just keep the equipment here the whole time, but still moving through the lunges and the squats. You got it. And then if the weight just becomes too much, all together, guys, you can drop it. Two more. Come on. A little lower. A little smaller, pull a lot better. One left, one left. Let your legs feel. We're gonna do it all in the left. Equipment, left hand, two throws. Step, lift, draw, same side. One, two, come on. Square the hips, squeeze the belly, and now the shoulder blade. Internal rotation, as we pull the elbow in. So it squeezes towards the center of the back. Well, it's got legs, right? Left side, single back stepping left. Step, drop, lift, repeat. So, what tends to happen as we get higher, the shoulders roll forward, creating excessive lumbar flexion. As you step back, keep your shoulder blades back so it keeps your chest up and your goggles in the world. But I know you want more. Here comes the combo, guys. Triple full slide, press. Big stance, triple full squat. Three, two, same side. Left leg, push. Big stance, squat, draw. So are you here? Or are you here? Come on. Halfway, guys, so ask yourself can I draw? A little lower. Can I make those pulses a little smaller? And can the shape come and strengthen? Just a little more. Because you got two left. Come on. Come on. Yes, you can. Yes, you can. Last one. Last one. Pull. Together. Let it go. Good. Good. Shake it out. Standing quad stretch. 
Knees together. Knees together. Hold the tailbone forward. Lift the chest. And if you need a wall, you can use a wall or a chair here. Switch sides. So we have one more. Uh, we're getting trapped, which means we have one more trap, but we're going to use weights, guys. This is the trap that you do not need a barbell on. <laughs> Alright, so you need either two plates or two dumbbells. If you're new, do smaller to medium. If you're regular, to medium or to large, get rid of the bench. Get rid of the Let me talk to you. Can you just pause it? <laughs> so get rid of the bench. The mat you can put to the side because you will see push-ups in this trap. So if you need a mat for support for your knees, for your hands, because all of the push-ups in this trap will be done on the floor. We're also going to see something in this trap, guys, and I'm going to quickly go over it because it's a real quick transition when we get there called a sprinter. What a sprinter is. Wrist under the shoulders. It's three fast mountain climbers. Three, two, one, with a little hold. Three, two, one. If that's too much today, same setup, wrist shoulder alignment, and you're just gonna steady knees down the middle. Still bringing the knee towards the chest. Still keeping the weight forward and the spine long. Good deal. So we are gonna start set position. Grab either your dumbbells or your plates. Music plates. Hi right, guys. So we got a couple different movements. We're gonna finish today strong. Upright row. Two, 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 one. Side raise. Two, one, two, one. All right. So no movement right line on the upper row. On the side raise. Ninety degrees in the arms. No higher than the shoulder. With the elbow. Come on. Come on. Don't forget to think about when we open, we're pivoting through the shoulder. Yes. Nice little lift. Nice little roll. Combo two. High pull. Two single. Lift. Rear shifting range. Tip forward. Open wide. Close and repeat. Two high pull. One rear raise. Yes! You got it. So on the high pull, lift the heel, push to the ball for feet, equipment, upper rib pacing. Side raise. Four, 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 three, two, one, four. All right, y'all. Combination. High pull, two single, lift. Straight, out, up, up. Alright, a little more back with the hips. A little more assistance in that hole. She's got it. One more team. One more. Alright, we're going to get back. So we're going to start. Stand up for a mid stance push up. Tight to the ribs. Chest forward, knees or toes. Two and two. Down, up, hold at the top for four. Again, down, up, hold. All right, so square. Three fast mountain climbers. Three, two, one, hold. Three, two, one, hold. All right, so back to knee. Down the center. Spine long. Tap the leg. Long turn. You're here. Slow it down. So what options do you need to do today? Two more. Push up. Two. Continuous. Two. 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 Hold. Grab your foot, guys. Set position. Plates are dumbbells. High pull. Two singles. Lift. Tipping raise. Out. In. Out. Up. So on the raise, body is solid. 
Shoulder blades squeeze together as you open wide with the arms and push your hips to the back of the ropes. That right, slow. Four, three, two, one. Hug your arms together. Hug your shoulders together. Check it. So I'm going to ask for it one more time. Hug. Hold. Two. Single. Two. Rearrange. Come on. A little more squeeze. A little more effort. A whole lot more reward. And I need two more. Lift. You guys, this is how we go. Strong lean body. Guys, pushing past is comfortable. Finding what's possible. Let it go. Come on down. I know you're excited. We're going to do one more round of this. Mid stance push up. So hands a little bit more narrow than usual. Chest up. Two, two, and down. Pull up the top of the floor. One more time. All right, breathe in, right? Sprinter. Three packs. Three, two, one, oh, three, two, one, oh. So, baby, keep going a little fast. Any other ones have to be slow. That's cool. Come back when you're ready. Because I'm not going to be for perfection. I'm going to be for perfection. And even if you want to be one fast, that's one more than two of them. One more. Push up. Two. Down. Down. All right. Keep going. Three, two, one. Push up. Two. Heel again. Push a little deeper. Heel in. Single. Eight. Come on. Keep this far. You can do it. Four, four. Four. Three. Come on. Down. Hold. Yes. Shake it out, guys. Shake it out. And we're coming. Right in the ass. So if you have a mat, set up. You don't need weights. You don't need a bench. All you use your body in the mat. Come on down. Supine position. Supine position. Chest to the ceiling. Feet close to the butt. Fingers to temple. Music, please. Now we're going to start easy, slow, two, two. Up, up, down, down. So you're turning the arms. Nice and light, guys. Rolling your shoulders away from the ground. And knees above the head. Hold oh, for four, three, Two, release. Four, yes. So we got options here. You can come with the knee crunch, or you can keep the leg on the ground with a bite. Hip bridge. Two, two. Up, up, down. We got one more. Breathe into it. Squeeze the glutes. Back to the full front. Three, kick. Four, three. High toe on the seat. High left feet. And your fingertips. Knees 
Let's go see other. Drop it through our chest. Relaxing through our upper body. And pushing our hips down towards our heels. Gently roll up in our right hand, slide through our left, softening through our shoulder, and just strong and deeper into our stretch. Yeah, a rebel has a course. I'm heavy with your choices. Alright, guys, roll on up, and we're gonna take the right leg and pull it forward, sliding our left leg back. Coming into our seated or low to strike. And just walk it out and drop in. Walk in. Now you can decrease the legs. Then you can just lean forward. Add it up. Right leg sits forward. Flexor. Ankle in the right. Chest up. And just lift it as we drop in our back foot.